Hey guys, it's Dee Dee from Blue Patch Studio. I was about to work on this bucket and I thought, well, I'll just turn the camera on and visit with you guys while I play with this bucket. I had all these pins in this bucket in my church bag. So this bucket's going up and down the pews, all the little kids coloring and getting pens and pencils out. You know how that goes. So I decided to clean out my church bag one day and I pulled this bucket out. <laughs> what in the world must these parents be thinking of me? So I'm gonna cover this. Um, and I'm actually gonna use whatever, I came up here about four days ago and turned my glue gun on, so it's ready. And so I decided I better use it while it's good and hot. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna cover this and make it look cute with what I can reach. I'm, I'm not gonna go digging for anything. So I'm thinking about just maybe covering this with some papers first. Let's see what we got in here. Oh guys. These are my papers I made while I was in Arizona with the, um, let's see, I used some vellum and I used tracing paper and I used parchment paper. Look how cute those turned out. You know, I have boot coodles of lace for a journal page. Isn't that cute? Okay, we're not using those though. They were just right here in this bag. Let's see if there's anything in this bag we can use and that. It's not. Okay, so we might just start taking scraps of paper. This is pretty. And just putting a little on there until we get it covered. Yeah, we need to we need to do a little something with that. Okay, I'm not gonna use my glue. I think I'm gonna use this. Oh, this is what we're using. It is coming out. How oh, you like that? Oh, mercy. Okay, and I was just thinking, I'm not even going to put anything down on my, my mat. I love to, I have things like this all over my house that I have covered and, you know, glued stuff on. Did I show you guys, I showed you guys my garbage can, I think, one day when I was in here crafting. Okay, let's see what else we got in here. Here's a piece of this. I'm telling you, this three in one's ready to go. Look at it. Ooh, it is coming on out. And I hope this sticks because I used this and I used hot glue on my Velcro. Let's go this way. My Velcro that holds my TV remote on the side of my... Hey, if I don't put that up there, it'll get buried and I'll never find it. I need some of these on it. You know how we lose our glue top? I need a big something on my, <laughs> my remote. Now, I could have used Mod Podge. I didn't think about it. So, it'll be all right. And I'm not sure if the glue stick, let's try the glue stick. Let's see if it works. been up here in a while. Okay, I'm making sure y'all can see. We might better get a little piece of paper. I have missed my desk and being in here and crafting. Now, later on, I might go back over this and give it a coat of something just so that it's sealed up good you know 
but for now. And I'm I'm not using scrapbook paper. I'm using thinner paper. So so it's um not as heavy because heavy paper is a lot harder to get to lay down and act right sometimes. Let's just go. Well, that helped. That went on pretty good. That'll work. And probably with uh, Mod Podge on top, it'll be fine. Oh, let's use some of this so grungy. Look at there. It's got Holy Spirit on it. we got to use that now. So we're trying to cover this up. Let's see. Hmm. Whoops. So it was supposed to rain here all day. So I was thinking, oh yeah, I'm going to spend some time upstairs. It has not rained a drop. Sun's been shining, breezy. So maybe it's going in another direction. Okay. I still have to get caught up on my Marguerite Miller, too. Boy, it's... Come on, that end. I'm probably getting behind. I don't even know what week we're on. Just don't know. Oh, I'm going to go all the way across right there. We watched a good movie last night. Um, I think it was called Dog with Channing Tatum. It was really good. Oh, I don't wanna cover that much. Let's put the brakes on this. Cover too much. I don't want to cover all my. Paper. See, I don't like that straight edge, but y'all didn't tell me. Okay, now what about around this bottom? How about a strip? Something. This looks fun. Why is that folded? Yeah, that movie was really good. It was really good. I, I was worried it was going to be sad. It was a little bit, but it was good. So you need, guys need to go check it out. And we watched another one um, a few nights ago with him in it. And it was The Lost City, maybe? Maybe, I'm not sure. Lost, something like that. I'm sure you could Google it and find it pretty easy. Yeah, it is. Oh, these are thick. Thick, thick, thick. Let's see what we got in this little basket. Hey, let's do a little piece of this. several of these little buckets from somewhere. They would be there. I said, I need those buckets. That's... I don't like them straight edges. Let's 
now. Okay, that's covered. Took care of that straight edge. This one's gonna be tricky. Yep. Show Liz. Hey, but it ain't nothing but a thing. Nothing a little glue and paper can't handle. Right? Where'd it go? All right, our bucket is pretty much covered. Now, I'm gonna go around this with a piece of lace and it's gonna be so stinking cute. That's what we're gonna use our glue gun for. Okay, what do we want on there? I got lace out the wazoo. You know what, I probably won't use this because it's ruffledy. I don't know, mine. That would be cute. Let's do that. Let's don't even think about it. Let's find some scissors. Maybe these will cut. Just want to trim this off straight. All right, glue gun. I'm going to go between. Oh, look at there. Some baked that stuff. Yes, I'm the world's worst at plugging something up and forgetting about it or turning the water on and forgetting about it or putting something on to cook and forgetting about it. Um, I really need adult supervision most of the time, you guys. Yes, I already told y'all how I do my daughter when I'm on the phone with her. I forget I'm on the phone with her. I forget she's actually on the phone and not here. Go outside, and then I remember. Oh my gosh, I was on the phone with her. She's just waiting patiently on the phone still. She knows I'll be back. Guys, I just don't know how we make it when we can't craft. Oh, it's just so much fun. Fun. Okay, I'm going to cut this off because that's where the handle goes. And I just put my hands in it. I let it cool off and then I put my hands in it. How cute is that? Okay, well, now let's go down the other side. And I don't know which is the front and which is the back. I guess if I can't tell, nobody else can. I better put a little glue under that. husband's wanting to go clean his shop. And I think he's wanting me to go help him. Y'all know how I feel about that. I want to say, I did not make that mess. But he is so stressed out about it. I think my son might have did most of it. He got up this morning and he was just mad. He was just slamming and knocking things. Off. Like, what in the world? And then, while we were eating breakfast, he started saying, 
I'm just dreading going to my shop. So he woke up with that on his mind. Okay. How cute. That looks kind of silly with that gap, don't it? Hey, I got an idea. Now, Lord, it just broke into a sweat. How about that? That is cute. Now we can put our little handle back on it. And put our pins back in it. get no them dirty looks in church because my bucket uh okay that's too cute yes these all go in my bag because you just never know i used to have a glue stick in there and then i thought mm, i don't need them little cheering to be gluing anything at church oh that's great that won't be working anymore. Yeah, this started out as just um, crayons. You know, these these crayons. Then I got a few markers in there. Then some pencils got stuck in there. Oh, and, and we even have a paintbrush in there. Some highlighters. Yeah. So that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. I will be back soon with my Marguerite Miller challenge. So hopefully I will see you guys in the next video. Have a blessed day. Bye.